god, I look really bad. But it's because I've literally had two breakdowns and it's not even one o'clock. The airport left my baggage in Barcelona. First of all, I thought I was gonna miss my plane, but I break down on the plane. Everyone was watching me and I was literally like flying to the air hostess. I just realized it's an excuse to go shopping. Hey, I don't know if it's recording or not. Shit. Oh, it is recording. Hey, we're going to the Spanish steps now, so we're gonna cue the montage in three, two, Shops subdued, and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. There's such nice stuff, and there's a top I want to buy for 26 euros. It's but so Matt says it's not worth it. No, you said it wasn't worth it. Oh, but it's really cute. And look at this little chill area, it's so nice. It wasn't worth it for 26 euros. No. It says Brazil on it, it's like training on Instagram. Maybe it's, that's one I buy. Maybe because it's because I'm influenced by other people. Casual, casual one. Casual Italian behavior. <laughs> no, I'm joking, mom. We found them and now we're gonna get funguses for touching Ew. them. Gelato number one Ciao. of the trip secured. Me and more. What does that mean? What is that diving? Crash through the surface. This little thing right here is my dream horse. Isn't that so cute? baggage situation so basically they lost my baggage and it could be in a country that we have no idea silencio bruno silencio bruno silencio bruno silencio bruno can you still hear it no just you good hang on currently in the Vatican City, which did you know is a country, if you didn't know that, as well as Monaco, which is a country, which I had no idea until like three weeks after living in France. That's what's crazy is I'm in another country and I didn't even bring my passport. Rebel girl things. About to show you something crazy, okay, so you see this line, that's all the way, it starts over there and it goes all the way around there just to get into the church. That's a lot of people and that's a lot of queuing. I couldn't even wait that long in Gold Reef. Look at all this toilet paper over there. That went from Cannes to Nice to Barcelona to Palma and now to Italy. And now I have to leave it because my bag officially has no more space. I decided to take one to Florence. We are currently at the train station and we're about to go to Florence. But the train station's so cool. We look down there and there's like a bunch of like different food courts and stuff. I got myself a juice. Cookie cat. I don't know what it is. So I'm currently on the train and the others, I'm separated the others because they're flying. I mean, not they're flying, they're training. I don't know if that's the right thing. But they're training in business. I'm in coach. I think that's, is coach economy? I don't know. But anyways. And I wanted to say, I've got a few comments that I talk really fast. So I think I'm going to try slow it down for y'all. So just let me know. Like, I'll try correct myself if I do speak fast. But the only thing is I like speaking fast because then I feel like I can say more. I don't know if that makes sense. But I'll try to speak slower, I promise. Matta wants to put a flash to make the lighting go. We saw this guy. No, listen, listen, listen. We're on the place where we say, oh, we saw this guy. And he's like, hey, neighbors. No, but he said, and the way he said it, he was like, hey, neighbors. He sounded like Ned Schneebly or Ned Flanders. Oh my god, look at this guy over here. He looks so hot. Oh my god, this one right here. Oh, he's got a girlfriend. But look. I can now eat olives and I'm not even scared. Like, watch. Olive, okay. I just put olives on me. We're 
going to touch the nose of a pig and apparently it's good luck if you touch the nose which means my bags are going to come it's inside it I has to, to try to fall inside okay, okay. It, will. it will otherwise <laughs> <laughs> no! no. <laughs> and that's just Good Riding my pony. <laughs> it's moving, it's moving, it's moving. <laughs> come over to this place for cocktails it's called Santa and it's really fancy that they gave us a little iPad showing this cocktail and then twos is like it shows you the flavor and then you can like pick let's say this banana flavor I don't know that's probably really gross but you can pick banana and then choose like what it pairs well with I don't even know I don't even know but it's crazy I'll show you the cocktails they're probably gonna be magnifique oh, I feel like oh, I'm already day. drunk. So sad. That's officially the end of my Italy trip. But it was so much fun. And I'm so glad I got to see Manta. We literally had the best time. It was so cool. And I'll keep you updated on my luggage. I still haven't heard anything yet. But I've got a good feeling that it's going to come. I just feel like if I keep saying that it will come. So I'm just going to keep positive, you know. It's not like my whole entire life's in there. No, I'm joking. I'm not a materialistic person. I am now at the airport and I'm going to Ireland. I'm flying to Munich and then to Ireland, but I'm at Bologna airport and it was so funny. When we got off the train, we were going up the escalator and there was this girl on the other escalator and she was like playing on it while well, she was on her phone. So she wasn't looking and she tried to go up the wrong escalator, the one that's coming down. She tried to go up and she couldn't figure out what, so she kept like going back and forth and she kept like falling and it was so funny. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the vlog and thank you for hanging out with me and spending time with me and I love you loads and I can't wait to see my mom. Those boys just walked past me they gave me such funny looks. I'm not a loner. Whatever. But anyways, I love you. Bye.